Guilford College, we have a very unique program. It's called the Higher Education in Prison Program. It started in January of 2014, and it's essentially a program where we're offering liberal arts courses in three correctional facilities. Any education gives a wonderful stepping stool, and there's not a lot of opportunities throughout the system for that. And for this to be from Guilford, to be such a high-level school, to come in and give us these things out, I can't even express what that meant to my spirit. Um, to be able to have that opportunity. Our goal is to simulate as much of the Guilford College experience that our students have on campus in these facilities. Only difference is that they don't have access to the internet. They don't have computers. If you can learn in prison where you have to write an eight page paper by hand without any Google, no typewriter, no nothing to do it and you're writing it by hand and you're doing a decent job so that your professor can read it and grade it and you still get your point across. I think if you take that as a life lesson to the outside that that is you can accomplish anything you want to accomplish no matter where you are. I must say we had a, a wonderful celebration in December when we had our first uh, nine of the 15 original cohort to graduate from the uh, from our program at the women's prison in the Southern Correctional Institution and I was so proud of them they worked so hard. I fell along the lines of uh, the statistics that we studied I didn't realize that I was a statistic um, and I don't want to be a statistic anymore so this class showed me that I have permission I can give myself permission to fail and I can give myself permission to rise and conquer, and that's what I give myself permission to do today.